Welcome back to the Baddest Show. In case you're just tuning in, this right here is Grapevine. And as always, it is a pleasure to have you on board. Now, let me get you on to day two of the October Festival. And this time round, we had heavyweights taking the stage, beginning with Nobuku himself. We had Ben Sol, we had a major, and all the way from Tanzania, we had Diamond Platinums taking the stage as well. You definitely want to see how it went down, so I won't waste your time. Let's get into it. <laughs> From day one of the October festival, we dive straight into day two. On day two, the grounds were fully packed. Just as last year, this festival yet again managed to pull one of the biggest crowds. People came out in numbers ready to have an unforgettable experience, this time round celebrating the East African culture and music in all its diversity. The lineup was exceptional. DJ sets got revelers into the groove of the evening with the MCs of the day taking up their task. Some time past midnight, just some few minutes shy to 1 a.m., festival goers finally got to witness an East African giant. He started off with one of the most dance songs this season before he gave us a taste of his throwback music. It was so certain that he had a commendable catalogue as he went on and on and on singing some of his slow tunes as well as the fast-paced ones. The final act of the night was none other than Totoa Hadija himself, Major Okwonko. Yeah. 
Major pulled on some theatrics where he came in rolled on a hospital stretcher, probably getting his fans ready for his ambulance hit. <laughs> Together with his personal DJ, dancers, and his hype man Super Marcus, they had an amazing rapport on stage. The festival goers attending day two will attest to how great that night was. East African music are becoming one and um, Kina Diamond and Kina Nyashinsky, each and everyone, like to work up a moja, you get. And it also just um, exemplifies the things like, yo, know, like let's say the Afcon. I don't think we'll have so much difference because to Mokwa Kituki Moja. I think I've really enjoyed the music industry this year. I've seen an improvement. I've really had a lot of fun with music events, with concerts. So yeah, it's really improved this year. Talking in terms of being an artist and also being a radio presenter, I can say we are really growing. You can see from what October Task has been doing with October Fest, we've been seeing over 100 acts performing, yeah? That's a win for us. And no flows, I can also say the, from the transition from Genge to Abanton, I mean, it's amazing. I love the culture, I love where we're heading to, and I love each and every person watching, yeah? What you gotta do?